Hi, I'm Jake Trotter from NewsOK.com along with Barry Trammell. We're sitting here at Cowboys Stadium where Brigham Young has upset the third-ranked suitors 14-13 on a game-winning drive. Tressway missed a 54-yard field goal attempt at the end to win it. Barry, your thoughts of the game? Well, I mean, you lose Sam Bradford and your chances of winning go down considerably, but the truth is Oklahoma struggled before Sammy went out. First half was a string of penalties and turnovers and offensive ineptitude, and things certainly didn't improve when Land Landry Jones came in. So, uh, you know, this is, uh, this is a game you hope you can steal without Bradford, but it's no surprise that uh, Oklahoma lost playing the way it did. Sure weren't held by the penalties on the offensive line from the get-go. The offensive line was was inconsistent and really undisciplined. It seemed like that was the, a big factor for the Sooners. Well, just uh, three false start penalties on the first drive of the game. In the second half, Landry Jones making his debut. Uh, first down of his first series, major penalty. It's first and 24. Next drive, holding, 10-yard penalty, first and 20. You're putting the guy in a terrible situation. And it just, uh, you know, this was became a condensed game, not that many possessions. And the Sooners squandered too many with penalties. And, uh, you know, late in the game, uh, the game came down to, I think, two sequences. Both teams got uh, pass interference in the end zone, giving both teams a first and goal at the two. Brigham Young scored from the two. Oklahoma did not. Sooners lose by one point. Bradford and uh, tight end Jermaine Gresham uh, going to be out for who knows how long. Going forward after this loss, uh, as a Sooner fan, where do you go from here? Well, you're, you're thankful if you're a Sooner fan that Idaho State's up next. Um, I think uh, just about any of us could quarterback Oklahoma to victory against Idaho State. But uh, after that, you try to get past Tulsa if Bradford's out. And then you've got an open date. Then you go to Miami. You're going to need Bradford in Miami. Uh, the way Oklahoma played tonight, there's not a lot of teams they could beat without Bradford. So uh, his health becomes very important. And, uh, you know, all is not lost on this season if this team – uh, can somehow figure out what's wrong on the line and for guys like DeMarco Murray and Ryan Broyles to hang on to the ball, then, uh, you know, it, it could contend for a championship again. There were some bright spots. The defense was fabulous, I thought. You hold Brigham Young to 14 points. I don't care if you give up a late drive to get to from 7 to 14. 14 should be enough to win against a Brigham Young. Uh, defense was uh, spectacular. Uh, defense can carry this team if they get a little bit of help from the offense. Sooners lose tonight, 14-13, take on Idaho State. Next week for Barry Tremel, I'm Jake Trotter. Thanks for watching NewsOK.com. <laughs>